Welcome back, fellow adventurers. Today, we're diving into the enchanting world of Skyrim with a special showcase of the must-have mods for July 2023. From thrilling new spells to breathtaking landscapes, we've got it all covered. So grab your swords and spells because this is going to be an epic journey into the realm of modding. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and let's get started. The first mod I want to introduce to you is the Modern Stagger Lock Framework. The Modern Staggerlock Framework is an SKSE plugin and behavior patch framework that brings the modern action game style Staggerlock animations to Skyrim. It introduces a continuous stagger behavior, allowing you to stagger an actor twice and more. Currently, it supports Humandio, Draugr, and Falmer. You can also enjoy custom stagger animations with annotatable transition windows for Humandio actors. Additionally, there's an option to disable the player's jump while staggering. One of the mods that utilizes the modern stagger lock framework is the recently updated Elden Rim Weapon Arts. Now, when the player blocks, appropriate stagger animations are displayed. While blocking with a shield, the character may be slightly pushed back or show signs of flinching. The remarkable aspect is that this stagger effect applies not only to the player, but also to all humanoid NPCs. Especially when the actor blocks an enemy attack with depleted stamina, they will stagger significantly, resembling the feeling of playing Elden Ring. However, it's important to be cautious when blocking attacks from creatures like bears. Blocking their attacks recklessly will cause you to fall backward, leaving you vulnerable. If you are interested in soul-like combat mechanics, it's worth paying attention to the modern stagger lock framework and its implementation in the Elden Rim Weapon Arts mod. This time, allow me to introduce you to JK's Markarth Outskirts, a mod that provides a lore-friendly overhaul of the Markarth Outskirts, including the Stables, the Salvius Farm, and the Left Hand Mine. JK's mod beautifully enhances the previously barren Markarth Outskirts with stunning buildings and intricate decorations, resulting in a significant aesthetic upgrade to the entire Markarth area. The buildings are thoughtfully adorned with flags, carriages, and Dwemer-inspired elements, creating a diverse and visually captivating environment. This is a recommended mod for players who like creator JK's City Decoration mod, but it's worth noting that due to the addition of numerous buildings and mesh objects, there might be a potential impact on framerate. To ensure a smooth experience, it's recommended to conduct a frame test before deciding to apply the mod. This time, let me introduce you to the Fettered Fragments mod. It adds unique whips and scythes made of floating fragments to Skyrim. Fettered Fragments have a mesmerizing appearance as they float and swirl, featuring applied physics that allow them to stretch up to twice their original size, making them truly unique weapons. You can bestow one of seven different attributes to both the whips and scythes of Fettered Fragments. By crafting special spell tomes, you can summon weapons with the desired attribute, for instructions on how to craft these weapons, you can visit the YouTube description link provided in the Test Nexus site description. If you're interested, feel free to give it a try. The mod I want to introduce to you is Kingsglaive Moveset for ADXP MCO. This moveset is a combination of Kingsglaive, extreme bound weapon play, with animations from various authors, finely tuned and adjusted. To use this moveset, you'll need to equip the Kingsglaive weapon as a prerequisite. The animations are incredibly dynamic, featuring elegantly summoning weapons with fitting blue effects, adding to the overall visual splendor. For players who desire a mix of flashy effects and stylish attack styles, I highly recommend trying out the Kingsglaive moveset. This exceptional moveset has been carefully curated, incorporating the latest motions from renowned animation creators. You won't be disappointed with the selection. The mod I'm going to introduce to you is called Spaghetti's Orc Strongholds All-in-One. This comprehensive mod, crafted by Rubber Spaghetti, serves as an all-in-one solution that replaces the Orc Strongholds in Skyrim. The creator has put great effort into transforming the Strongholds into something truly impressive. They took compatibility with other mods into consideration, and ensured that the changes made are optimized for smooth FPS performance. Although I personally haven't explored the Strongholds extensively, I must admit I haven't installed this mod myself. Nevertheless, if you have a desire to revamp the Strongholds entirely, 
This mod will undoubtedly be a convenient and impressive option to achieve just that. So if you're looking for a seamless and immersive transformation of the strongholds, I highly recommend giving Spaghetti's Orc strongholds all in one a try. This time, let me introduce a mod that you absolutely must install once you become aware of it. At first I didn't pay much attention to this mod, but as I observed the Solitude outskirts I couldn't resist installing it. It's called Phyx, Solitude Arch, and it addresses the glaring mesh issues that left gaps and holes in the Solitude outskirts. It was a serious problem. Whenever I saw those gaps, my immersion vanished instantly. Why did Bethesda leave these issues untouched? Was it because of the it just works mentality? If you've seen this video, I urge you not to overlook it. You should definitely install Fix, Solitude Arch, and eliminate all those gaps in the Solitude outskirts. It will greatly enhance your gaming experience. Next up. Introducing Ambient Bird Sounds Expanded, a fantastic mod that enhances the immersive experience in Skyrim by adding an array of captivating bird sounds to the game's environment. As you venture through Skyrim's vast landscapes, you'll be greeted by the soothing melodies of birdsong, creating a more dynamic and lifelike atmosphere. From the bustling towns to the tranquil wilderness, the sounds of various bird species will enrich your exploration, making the world feel even more alive. The creator of Ambient Bird Sounds Expanded has put great effort into carefully selecting and blending the bird sounds, making sure they blend harmoniously with the existing game audio. This attention to detail results in a truly immersive and natural soundscape that seamlessly integrates with the game's ambience. Whether you're an avid nature enthusiast or simply appreciate the little details that make a game world come alive, Ambient Bird Sounds Expanded is a must-have mod for enhancing your Skyrim experience. Immerse yourself in the enchanting world of Skyrim like never before, and let the birdsong transport you to new heights of adventure. The last mod I'd like to introduce to you is the Kitty Tail Abyssal Wind Magic by the talented creator. This fantastic mod brings 12 new poison and wind spells tailored for dark mages and assassin type characters. The poison spells included in this mod are particularly deadly, inflicting debilitating effects on your foes. They are perfect for setting up deadly traps or dispatching enemies silently and efficiently. On the other hand, the wind spells showcase incredible force and impact, allowing you to manipulate the very air around you in battle. You can find the spell tomes added to the leveled lists, and they will become available as your skill level in the relevant area increases. Additionally, the poison spells can be acquired from necromancers and warlocks, while the wind spells can be purchased from Talvis Fethrian after completing the Wind and Sand quest. One of the standout features of this mod is the awe-inspiring Summon Falling Star Thrasher power. With this ability, you can summon a mighty and fearsome creature to your aid during combat. However, be forewarned that upon the first summon, the creature will be hostile to everyone. Show your medal and defeat it, and on subsequent summons, it will become a loyal and formidable ally in your battles. To unlock the potential of the Summon Falling Star Thrasher power, you'll need to locate its spell tome on Calselmo's enchanting table in Understone Keep. In conclusion, the Kitty Tail Abyssal Wind Magic mod is a must-try for those seeking a more captivating and immersive experience in the world of Skyrim. With its unique spells and fascinating mechanics, it will undoubtedly enhance your gameplay and leave you in awe of the vast possibilities that magic has to offer. And that's a wrap for our July 2023 Skyrim Mod Showcase. We hope you enjoyed discovering these amazing new additions to the game. Make sure to check the video description below for the links to all the mods featured today. If you found something you loved, don't hesitate to give it a try and immerse yourself in a whole new Skyrim experience. Thanks for joining us on this adventure, and until next time, happy modding.